this is exercise 10 a this is exercise 10 a here you can see uh, find the diameters of the circles given the following areas here the areas of the circles are given areas of the circles are given so with the help of these areas of the circle we have to find out the diameter of the circle sometime the examiner may give you the questions in which you are not required to use the calculator like p1 of mathematics so if this type of value is given so uh, it's better that use without use of the calculator you will have to solve it now you know that hmm. uh, you area of circle is equal to pi r square we have to find out the diameter obviously if we will be able to find out the radius of the circle then double the radius of the circle will be the diameter now the area of circle is already given which is 616 millimeter square you will have to apply this value mean pi r square is equal to 616 okay now you know that the value of pi you can take is 22 over 7 r square is equal to 616 and r square is equal to 616 when this 22 over 7 will go to the other side 22 over 7 will go to the other side it will be shifting like 7 over 22 you can use the table of 11 or you can directly divide it by the table of 22 like you can see 22 twos are 44 11 minus 4 is 7 176 and 22 eights are 22 eights are 176 so this is 28 times i am cancelling it 28 times and 28 sevens are 7 eights are 56 7 twos are 14 14 plus 5 19 196 what r square is equal to 196 so by taking the square root of this radius r square r is equal to r is 14 millimeter you know that uh, double of the double of the radius is diameter we have to find out the diameter of the circle so diameter is equal to 2 times of radius mean 2 into 14 is equal to 28 millimeter okay so in this way you can find out all the parts when the area of the circle is given so using the area of the circle you can very easily find out the radius and then double the radius you can find out the diameter yes